Giornata molto importante in casa Novara FC con la presenza di mister Nasser Altamimi allo stadio Silvio Piola per la prima volta. C'è stato un incontro questa mattina con il presidente Massimo Ferranti. Praticamente le parti sono molto molto vicine all'accordo. Eh, insomma Altamimi è vicinissimo ad essere il nuovo proprietario del Novara. Ancora non è stata chiusa definitivamente la questione, ma questo è quello che traspare insomma, da quello che hanno detto sia Altamini sia eh, Ferranti. L'incontro ha sicuramente portato aspetti decisamente positivi, ormai l'accordo quindi sembra essere ad un passo per un Novara che eh, di fatto dovrebbe diventare di proprietà araba. Il prossimo passo sono le ultime verifiche di alcuni numeri, alcuni dati per poi arrivare al closing dal notaio che potrebbe essere intorno al 18-20 settembre. Andiamo a sentire direttamente le parole di mister Nasar Altamimi che racconta quali sono i suoi obiettivi per il futuro e parla di ambizioni di un certo livello. Different uh, small clubs around the world, but Nevada is something else. It's something like because of the history, the image, also the, of the club, the city, and we know also the the fun of the Nevada. They are love their team, and they are always behind the team. So that's why also one of the positive uh, to attract us to to be here and to to discuss and for the, to buy the clubs. So Novara is different, it's not a, like the regional club that uh, you own in, with relationship. No, no, it's something that's very, uh, uh, first the reputation is a, it's a very, very uh, high, high stand, plus also the, the quality of the city, quality of the facilities, uh, the stadiums, and the people, so okay. that's important. And the so, name uh, will remain uh, Novara? Novara, sure. Novara 100%. And we try to get, to get either the, the, old the, the old names and the old logo. Okay. From, from the chapter 11. Okay. Can, can you describe yourself? Who is Nazareth? Well, like you know. oh, I'm since I am, I'm, I'm in child, my child, my start from my childhood, I'm a sportman. Okay. I am ex uh, professional uh, basketball yeah. players. Uh, I am uh, in, uh, involved with the judo and yeah. international level and local level and also involved with the, the football and the different clubs around the world. So my life is 100% for the, for the sport. I have private company, but my, my passion, what I love, is the sport. But what is the private company? I have private, like a building material, I have private. Ah, yeah, travel PDM, agents, PDM. yes, and those companies, which is... But I see myself more in, uh, in the football or in the sport in general. Uh, so, how long time we had to stay before you decide? It takes time, it was like not, long, not long, long, but because of the, of the reputation and the, the history of the clubs, it's easy, you can read it and you can uh, love it, you know? So the sport end of the day, how much you love the things, they love the sport or you love the club, you know. So from the, the day one, we are checking the clubs, the history of the clubs. We, we, we've been in love with the, uh, the city and the, uh, and the club also because it gives us like some nice feeling when we okay. read uh, uh, about the club. You are optimist. Of course, of course. Can you say perché adesso per per la trattativa? Non è che si fa così. Myself, with my team, with my team and partner, I think we are our plan to put Nevada in the world map, not just Italia. World map, the world map. This is our yes. Do you know that it's a small city with a small no, state? You said this is a small city, but there is no, there is an, in the sport, there is nothing impossible, everything visible. So that's why we are, the first thing, we are thinking about it, how we put Nevada in the world map. You, 